Cowboys 18H at M. Betcher, Getty Images Minneapolis, Minnesota, October 14, Georgia Loca. Bank Stadium on October 14, 2018 in Minneapolis, Minnesota, photo by Adam Betcher, Getty Images by SportsDayDFW.com at SportsDayDFW Editor's Note, this story has been updated since it was first published. On Friday, the Dallas Cowboys brought in a third safety this offseason for a visit. However, he has left without a deal, the Dallas Morning News' David Moore reports former Vikings safety George Aloka has left his visit without a contract. George Aloka has completed his visit with the Cowboys. Aloka is the third safety to visit the star. Aloka is the third safety to visit the star this week. The Cowboys brought in free agent safeties Eric Berry and Clayton Gathers. Gathers has since resigned with the Indianapolis Colts and Berry is still being wined and dined by other clubs. John Oning, a special contributor to the news, recently identified Aloka as one of three safeties Dallas could target without breaking the bank. The Cowboys have roughly $14 million in available cap space according to Spitrack.com. Here's what Owning had to say about Aloka, listed at 6 foot 4, 225 pounds, George Aloka is the prototype, in terms of size, for the strong safety position on the Cowboys defense made famous by Cam Chancellor with the Seattle Seahawks. Aloka spent the 2018 season with the Minnesota Vikings after becoming a salary cap casualty of the Cincinnati Bengals in August 2018. Though he performed well at times, Aloka was not a great fit in Mike Zimmer's defense, where he was forced to play a large percentage of snaps in cover 2 and cover 4. Given his skill set, Aloka would be a much better fit in the Cowboys scheme, where they play mostly cover 1 and cover 3, as a strong safety, playing a healthy portion of snaps around the box. Aloka displays the type of skill set that should lend itself well around the box. He has great instincts and discipline against the run, and he packs a punch when he arrives with the momentum. Because of his unique size for the position, Aloka, unlike most safeties, has the ability to take on and play off blocks in the run game, especially against tight ends and fullbacks. While most safeties opt to jump around blocks, opening up giant running lanes, Aloka possesses the requisite power to hold his own at the point of attack. Against the pass, Aloka appears to be much more comfortable defending short to intermediate zones than manning the deep half or middle. He shows plus mental processing from the box, reading his keys well to identify what an offense is trying to do, thus rarely getting out of position. Aloka has the size and physicality to hang with tight ends in coverage, but he can become a liability against quicker receivers, lacking the fluid change of direction ability to hang with them. Aloka's length enables him to give pass catchers a lot of trouble at the catch point while condensing throwing windows for quarterbacks in the intermediate parts of the field. This is especially important in the red zone, where length exacerbates things for offenses because space is condensed as it is. Signing Aloka would give the Cowboys an upgrade over Heath without breaking the bank, allowing Heath to do what he does best, focus on special teams. Under Chris Richard, who has a proven track record of developing long and tall defensive backs, Aloka could play the best football of his career. The 2012 fifth-round pick has totaled 362 tackles, 9 interceptions and 32 pass deflections in 99 career games. Aloka has the ability to play both strong and free safety which makes his services attractive for Dallas. His visits is a sign that the team is pessimistic about its chances to land Barry, the top available safety on the open market.